There's a reason you feel anxious, stuck, and unmotivated, and it's not all in your head. It may actually be from your gut. Don't chat GPT it, let me explain. Gut is actually called your second brain. It's home to over 100 million neurons. That's more than your spinal cord. And it talks to your brain all day long through something called the vagus nerve. That line of communication between the brain and the gut is two-way. And there's actually more communication that goes from your gut to your brain than from your brain back to your gut. When your gut bacteria is healthy, it sends signals that keeps your brain calm and balanced and your mood stable. When they're off balance, they send stress signals instead. Good bacteria help us produce serotonin and dopamine, which are neurotransmitters. About 90% of our serotonin and about 50% of our dopamine are actually made in our gut, not our brain. Serotonin is our feel-good neurotransmitter. Dopamine is a neurotransmitter transmitter that helps us with motivation, focus, and drive. So when your gut bacteria is unhealthy, your mood tanks, your focus drops, and anxiety can spike. And here is where it gets wild. A healthy gut doesn't just make you happier. It makes your brain more adaptable. That's neuroplasticity, your brain's ability to rewire, learn, and grow. When the gut is inflamed, that wiring literally slows down and you get stuck in patterns mentally and emotionally. The problem is our modern lifestyle with antibiotics, processed foods, and chronic stress about the bacteria that keep your brain sharp and your mood stable. The solutions. Eat whole, real foods, make sure you get your fiber, support your stress and sleep management and recovery, and then consider brain retraining. If you want a better mood, focus, and emotional balance, start with your gut. Feed it real food, work on stress management techniques, and look into non-invasive therapies that can help to retrain your brain.